Let's get some uh, some minutes in the legs, I guess, against some yeah, fairly decent yeah, opposition. Yeah, my first 90 minutes, so I'm feeling it now. But no, I think there's a lot of positives for us to take from, from that. There's a lot of decent passing and good play. So, yeah, it's another tough test, but it'll, it'll all be worth it come the fourth. I guess playing against the Premier League side is kind of like going back to when you were younger and stepping up an age group or two. It's, it's the only way you get better, and perhaps it means that when you then come back to League Two level, you go, actually, we've seen worse than this. Yeah, yeah, I think that's it. That's what the gaffer said. Like that's why he's got these tests for us, and this is why we're playing such high quality in pre-season, just to, to see the standard that we need to get to. And yeah, it's been it's been a good learning curve for us all. I think come the fourth, we'll be more than ready for what we have got in front of us. We keep hearing about how the the gaffer and his coaching staff is beasting the squad at the moment, putting you through a really tough pre-season. Tell us about it. Uh, yeah, well, it's been it's been difficult. It's like this, especially this week, it's been a few hill runs in that. And, it's not nice, it's not enjoyable, but it's just, just something that you've got to do just to make sure that you're ready come the start of the season. So it'll just give us the best chance possible to, to go and do what we we'll have to do. Two weeks out now, do you, do you feel ready? Yeah, well, I think there's one or two things that are still to come together yet, but we've got two weeks and another game. So I think inside that we'll, we'll get things right and we'll be bang on it for the start of the season. He played against Leicester today, Derby last Saturday. Um, they expose perhaps certain things quicker than a League Two club will do. Do you think maybe next week at Luton will be a, a, a truer test of, of where the squad is at? Yeah, I think so, because obviously Luton, were, we were playing them last year, so I think it'll be more more around our level. So I think, yeah, it'll be another another decent test for us. So it should, should be good, yeah. What's it, what's it like now? I mean, if you can tell me, how it feels different, perhaps, to when you left the club at the end of May to rejoin it in July? Um, well, obviously, there's a lot of new faces and that brings more competition for places. So I think the standard in training has gone up again from what it has last year. And obviously, we need that just to keep everyone on their toes. So I think this year is looking to be an exciting year for everyone. Who's the toughest striker to mark in training? In training? Probably say... Kane Hammonds at the minute, yes. Yeah, decent movement. Is that what he does well? It's his movement. Yeah, and his hold-up play. You can, you can see the daylight. He was holding defenders off, and yeah, he's, he's a strong boy. So yeah, he's looking good for us. And you should not get elbowed in the head by Shola. Right? No, I guess no, that's a no, no. Yeah, there's always a positive. In there. How did the move come about coming back here? And do you feel like a, an old head, or do you feel like you're one um, of the new boys? No, well, obviously, when at the end of last year, like the way it ended, I didn't, nobody wanted it to end that way. So I think it was sort of unfinished business, sort of thing. So yeah, it was I, could, I couldn't wait to get back. Like when I knew that. The interest was still there, so I just said to the agent, yeah, this is where I want to be, and I think it's the right, right time for me in my career at the minute. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what the season brings.